Hey guys, it's JC Chandler. I am popping on just to uh, give you guys a, some a tip on how I clean my resin brushes. Now, this may not work for everyone, but this is how I do it, and I wanted to make sure that you know I answered a question that was asked of me. Someone asked me, "How do I clean my resin brushes?" So when I say that I brush on resin, like I did in my previous um, short, this group of brushes I get in a pack, I don't know, I think they are a pack of 12, I'm not sure. I got these from Timu, and it's probably a pack of 10. But I like to use these brush, this brush, to brush on just kind of a an individual coat of resin and not necessarily dome it like that so the brush on resin is done when i want my back to look like this or smoother something like that all right so it's pretty simple. I don't do much of anything. I'm going to grab one that I have some resin on. These two have resin. One is probably hard. Yeah, there's one that's soft still. And then that one has gotten a little hard. And that's fine. But um, this one I'll probably use one more time before I toss it. Because once it gets this hard... I'm not sure that it'll clean. I have a silicone mat here. I'm putting the resin on the silicone mat because it cleans up pretty good um, when it is um, on here. So here's what I do. Basically, alcohol and wet wipes. Now this is not gonna necessarily clean every single bit of the resin off, but usually when I freshly use it, I put my alcohol in a little spray bottle and I'll spray on my um, surface, usually it's going to be a silicone placemat. And I will just kind of move the brush around in here. And if I have just used resin, on the brush, I'll take it and I'll wipe it with my wet wipe, just like that, and squeeze as much out as possible. Now this one is hard. Oh, let's see. There we go. So I'm gonna do it again, and I'm gonna use another wipe. And it's getting soft again, All right? So I'm gonna take that and wipe it up. And then I'm gonna go ahead and clean my brush. This is just because this is good enough for me for how I use it. And there's the brush. It still has resin on it, but it is not going to be dripping with resin like it was a second ago, right? And that's how I clean my resin brushes. I do the same exact thing Sometimes I'll use water for my glue brushes. Let's see if this loosens this up. This is alcohol and this one is soft, hard. Oh, it is used, loosening it up. Now this is how I do it. And it's just to get it to a point where I can brush it back on to my piece. All right, let me do this one more time. So it is soft. This one was the one that was a little hard when we first started. Spray it on here and on the brush. And then I just kind of dab it in and get saturated. Do a back and forth motion. This is now nice and soft. And I'm gonna squeeze as much as I can out of the brush wipe my alcohol up from my mat and toss and there we go 
I've got another a good, reasonably clean brush. This one is the one that I said I might toss in a couple days. So it's got some resin on it. I probably should be wearing gloves doing this. So it's still got some resin on it. And then this one is cleaner. It's still got some stuff on the end there. But this will allow me to brush on the resin more. So I'm gonna drop that down back into my little container and I'm going to clean my hands. This is just how I do it. I'm gonna put some alcohol on my hands, use my wipe, and then I'm gonna go and wash my hands with soap. I don't leave my hands like this because I get that alcohol off and make sure the resin is off. And that's how I clean my brushes almost immediately after I use the resin to brush it on. So that was my quick, short little uh, video on how to clean the, the resin off my brush. And it'll uh, allow my brush to last a little bit longer. So I hope that helps you guys and will allow you to continue to create something amazing. Talk to you later. Bye.